Phoebe, this is going to have a huge impact on the aluminium market because this country is the biggest exporter of bauxite. That's right. Giddy is a globally significant um, bauxite supplier uh, and key for us here in Asia. It's the key supplier of bauxite into China, which is the largest maker of aluminium. Um, more broadly, across aluminium, uh, we're seeing a bit of a supply shortage in China. Um, smelters there have been facing some power crunch issues in the country's south. And obviously, there's the broader push to rein in the industry's emissions which has come as global demand has boomed because of aluminium's significance in all of the world's clean energy transitions. So it does have the potential to um, drive prices quite high. What companies will be impacted here? Well, some of the major investors are, are people like uh, Rio Tinto, a major aluminium company, obviously Rusal as well, a major aluminium company. Uh, we have some Chinese uh, companies who are uh, invested in bauxite operations uh, in Guinea with the intent to sort of secure that uh, entire supply chain from um, ore right through to the finished product. Uh, so we might also see some share reactions as well as the raw material price reaction today.